WTFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien coming to you live from TFNN headquarters in St. Petersburg, Florida. It's Wednesday, 9 a.m. Eastern Time, 30 minutes to go until that opening bell. We got markets starting off to the downside. Dow futures negative 90 points, trading 27,573. S&P futures negative by about nine, trading at 3,082. S&P trading over 3,100 for the first time yesterday. NASDAQ futures negative by 27 points, trading 82.47. Got oil, negative 14 cents right now at 56.66. We get the EIA inventory number for crude at 10.30 a.m. Eastern Time. Tom and I will be on the air live for that. Gold contract up $9 right now at 14.63. You got silver up 16 cents at 16.85. And the 10-year yield pulling back a bit on yield, 1.877%. We have Chairman Powell speaking at 11 o'clock today. We have the impeachment hearings beginning at 10 o'clock today. Lots going on in the market. We'll start things off. We'll start it off with the VIX this morning. A little bit of negative action in the market, seeing a bit of an elevated VIX back above 13, 1323 in that volatility index. We'll jump over to the charts, start things off with the indices, start it off with the Dow. The Dow sliding from 27,630 down about 100 points to 27,529. That's the low just before 5 a.m. Eastern time, currently trading 27,581. NASDAQ 100, pretty similar story. We trade lower, reaching the lows just before 5 a.m. of, of 82.20. NASDAQ 100 trading 82.51. S&P 500 trading at 3,083, made a low of 3,075. So you're talking about a solid 25 S&P points, even more than that from where we traded intraday yesterday. Crude oil, $56.43. As I mentioned, an hour and a half from right now, we'll get those EIA inventory numbers. There's your gold contract, 1461. Gold been struggling a bit. Quite a low yesterday. You back this up. Gold making a low of 14, I think we're even below that. Yeah, 1446. There's that low at about 1040 a.m. And the euro US dollar trading at 11006. In terms of what else you have happening in the market, <coughs> excuse me, battling a little bit of a cold. Google getting into the banking business with the search giant set to offer checking accounts next year. Google checking coming at you fast. And the other news this morning, CPI increased more than expected in October, 0.4% last month, the largest gain in CPI since March. That number hitting just now. Stay tuned, folks. Larry Pezzavento coming up live with Trade What You See. I'll be back at 10 o'clock with Tom. We'll be right back.